Kak Devina bisa kembali menemani adik-adik for another LKC online service. Tapi seperti biasa, before we get start into our service, we're gonna start with a prayer. So I want you guys to put your prayer position, and we're gonna start this service with a prayer together. Okay, let's pray. Tuhan Yesus, terima kasih untuk hari ini. Kalau Tuhan sudah bisa mengumpulkan kami kembali, Tuhan, untuk ibadah hari ini. Tuhan, kau yang berkati ibadah kami hari ini dari awal sampai akhir. Kau yang penuhi kami dengan sukacita dan berkatmu, Tuhan. Menyerahkan ibadah kami hanya dalam nama Tuhan Yesus. Kami sedang berdoa dan mencari syukur. Terima kasih. Haleluya. Amin. Oke, okay, so let's start our service with, you know, praise and dance. We're gonna sing and dance. So I want you guys to stand up from your seat. And we gotta start our class play session. Okay, up, 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 let's go. It's a beautiful day. I wanna celebrate. I wanna tell everyone. I just can't wait. He is my friend. He is so great. He can do any, anything. I just can't wait.
Jesus is helping me I can do the things that he does I can love like Jesus I believe his light can shine through me I can do the things that he does I can love like Jesus I wanna be Because I definitely have some fun in singing and dancing for God. Tapi sekarang kakak mau mengajak adik-adik to go back to your sitting position. Because you know what? We're going to listen our Bible lesson for this week. Who's excited? I'm definitely excited for today's Bible lesson. But before we watch our Bible lesson, we're gonna pray. So I want you guys to be on your prayer position again. And we're gonna pray. Tuhan Yesus, terima kasih untuk uh, kesempatan yang Tuhan sudah berikan kalau kami masih bisa memuji nama Tuhan. Tuhan Yesus berkati supaya pujian kami bisa menjadi persembahan yang terbaik buat Tuhan Yesus. Tuhan, sekarang kami mau dengerin sedikit dari firman Tuhan. Tuhan yang siapkan hati, pikiran, dan telinga kami. Tuhan, supaya kami bisa fokus, kami bisa mengerti firman Tuhan hari ini. Terima kasih Tuhan Yesus, hanya dalam Tuhan Yesus. Kami sudah berdoa dan mengucap syukur terima kasih. Belia, amin. started thinking of all the fun things in a parade, like fire trucks and marching bands. It will be really fun and really loud. But our friend Sam does not like loud noises, and I don't want Sam to stay home because our parade will be too loud. So I thought that we could have a quiet parade. Will you help me? Wave your pretend streamers with me. Wave them high. Wave them low. Wave them all around. That's great. Hmm. Oh, I know what else we can use for our quiet parade. Rice shakers. These aren't too loud. Shake your pretend rice shakers with me. One, two, three. Shake! Great job! We're gonna have the best quiet parade ever! Who? Who? It's Ollie! Hello, Hayden! Who? Who? Playing the quiet game, are you? Oh, hi, Ollie! We're having a quiet parade because our friend Sam doesn't like loud noises. 
That's a great way to love. It's true. I know someone who loved everyone, too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. <laughs> Hello, friends. I'm Justin the Mailman, and today I am also the neighborhood parade leader. <laughs> It's a great day to have a great day. I'm delivering some invitations to the parade, and something exciting that you see at a parade is... Confetti! <laughs> There's confetti everywhere! Which reminds me of our story today. Do you want to hear it? Hooray! Let me just put the story mail in the mailbox. We've been learning how to love like Jesus. And just like confetti goes everywhere, Jesus' love goes everywhere too. And to everyone. Jesus wants everyone everywhere to follow him and be his friend forever. Today's true story from the Bible is about the first 12 people who followed Jesus. They were called the disciples. Like Peter and Andrew, they were fishermen out trying to catch fish when Jesus said, come follow me. So they did. James and his brother John were fishermen too. They were out there with their dad when Jesus said, come follow me. And they did. In the next town, Jesus found Philip. And then Philip brought Nathaniel to see Jesus and he followed Jesus too. Then there was Matthew. He had a different job. He was a tax collector. Matthew followed Jesus too. Then there was Thomas and James and Thaddeus and Simon and Judas. Whew, that's a lot. Let's see, do we have all 12? Let's count them. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, we did it. These were Jesus' 12 disciples. All different people from different places with different jobs and different families. But Jesus chose them all to follow him. Now, why do you think Jesus chose different people? Because Jesus loves everyone. He does. And Jesus wants us to love everyone too. Jesus wants us to love everyone, everywhere. Hi, Ali. Tell me, who can love like Jesus? I can love like Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Who can love like Jesus? I can love like Jesus. That's the truth, friends. Bye. So there's your story. And it's all true. Jesus was friends with everyone. And he wants to be friends with me and you, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow. Jesus loves everyone, and Jesus wants us to love everyone, too. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Good. I'm so excited for our quiet break because everyone can come. I know what else we need. Confetti! See you next time, bye! Walk in church! I'm Adik Adik. This week we learned that I can love like Jesus! Oke, okay, di minggu ini kita belajar di mana Tuhan Yesus memilih 12 muridnya. Oke, okay, 12. Tapi di cerita ini kita mau belajar bagaimana uh, Tuhan 
uh, menunjukkan kasihnya ketika memilih 12 muridnya ini Ketika kita belajar dan mengetahui background dari 12 murid yang Tuhan pilih ini Kita belajar kalau Tuhan mengasihi semua orang ketanpa terkecuali No matter what their background, no matter what their history, no matter what they did Tapi ketika Tuhan sudah memilih dan mengasihi orang itu, Tuhan pasti Akhirnya memilih 12 murid ini Nah, ketika This week we learned that ketika kita Mengasihi semua orang tanpa terkecuali Artinya kita sudah mengasihi Seperti Yesus That I can love everyone just like Jesus Oke, okay, remember that, oke okay, kids Oke okay, adik-adik uh, Ibadah kita hari ini sudah selesai Tapi sebelum kita end our service We're gonna close with a prayer So I want you guys to put your prayer position And we're gonna pray together Let's pray Tuhan Yesus, terima kasih untuk ibadah hari ini Kalau Tuhan sudah memimpin kami dari awal sampai akhir Tuhan Yesus, always help us Tuhan That in every day we can love like you Lord Terima kasih Tuhan Yesus uh, Menyerahkan aktivitas kami selanjutnya ke dalam tanganmu Kau yang pimpin kami, sertai kami, berkati kami Dan kembalikan kami lagi Tuhan next week for another online service Terima kasih Tuhan Yesus Hanya dalam waktu Yesus kami sudah berdoa Dan mengucap syukur terima kasih Haleluya Amin. Okay, kids. We'll see you next week. Bye. God bless you.